Now let's take a look at the piano. You can refer to diagram two if you need to, but if you're in front of the keyboard, that will do just fine. All right, so if you look on it, we have a whole bunch of white things and a whole bunch of black things. Those are actually called keys or notes, all right? So you can say keys or you can say notes. Keys are the physical things that are on the keyboard. Notes are the keys as well. They're just actually keys with a name. So if I refer to keys, or notes they're basically the same thing so don't be confused and I'm sure you won't be keys are the physical and notes are just again keys with names alright so we'll just move on from here alright let's take a look at the black keys as you can see there's groups of them there are groups of two there are groups of three and so on so as you can see on the keyboard groups of two three two three two three now depending on the size of your piano or keyboard whether it's 88 keys 76 keys or 61 keys or less the amount of groups of black keys will change so there therefore don't be worried about it we all have them but some have more but the only thing you need to know that there are a set of black keys which is two and three and that's all there is to know all right, so I want you to touch a set of black keys, any set. All right, now let's touch the set of two black keys, to be more specific. All right, now touch all the sets of two black keys along the keyboard. Go ahead. All right, now I want you to touch all the sets of three black keys on the keyboard. Every single one you see, all of them all together. Now the next thing you need to know is about going up and going down. All right, so that's not pointing to the ceiling or towards the floor, but how it relates to music. Okay, so when you go up, you go towards the right. So therefore, I want you to point to the right right now. That's right, point to the right. Whenever you go that way, that means you're going up. Now, if you wanted to go down, which way would you point? Not to the floor, but which way? That's right, you would point to the left. So therefore, if you're gonna go up, you're gonna point to the right. And I want you to do that with me. Do it again. Excellent, now if you're gonna go down, I want you to point to the left. Now do that again. All right, so now what I want you to do, I want you to put your finger on the lowest part of your piano, which should be all the way to the left because low is left, all right? Mine is gonna be over here. Now what I want you to do, I want you to slide your finger all the way to the right. You'll hear the sound as you go up. I'll let me demonstrate for you. I was going to the right. You see how the sound got higher? Now let me start from the top, which is my far right, and go all the way down to exercise how the down sound sounds. see how it started high and it went lower now you try let's try going all the way up for the first key on your left right all the way to the bottom of the left the extreme left that key that you find now slide it all the way to the top go ahead excellent now once you go to your extreme right which is the top of the keyboard where you can't go anymore and I want you to slide it all the way to the bottom excellent all right, so now you know which way is up and which way is down musically.